What we're seeing in NCAA college hockey this season is actually pretty incredible. The top teams are absolutely loaded with star-studded NHL talent, and these young players are just straight up dominating the sport. Seven of the top 10 scores in the NCAA this year are first round NHL draft picks or projected to go high in the first round in the 2024 draft. And nine of the top 10 scores are still playing and their teams are headed to the frozen four. I don't think we've ever seen this many elite NHL prospects putting up these insane numbers as early in their college careers as these guys are and with their teams having this much success as well. The two teams that have been at the top of the rankings all year long have been Boston College and Boston University. And shocker, these are also the two teams with the most high-end talent and top draft picks. BC has the best line in college hockey consisting of three freshmen who also all happen to play together for the U.S. National Development Team. They've got Will Smith, who is leading the nation in points with 69 in 39 games. He was drafted fourth overall by San Jose in 2023. Then you have Ryan Leonard, who was taken eighth overall in the same draft by Washington. He's got 31 goals and 59 points in 39 games. And the other winger on that line is Gabe Perot, who was taken 23rd overall by the Rangers also in 2023. He's got 57 points in just 34 games. The Eagles also have sophomore stud Cutter Gauthier, who was taken 5th overall by the Flyers in 2022. He's since been traded to Anaheim, but he is quietly having an insane season. His 37 goals in 39 games are the most by an NCAA player since Johnny Gaudreau during the 2013-14 season when Johnny Hockey had 36. BC also has one of the best goalie prospects in hockey in Jacob Fowler, who set the record for wins by a freshman goaltender with 31. He was a third round pick by Montreal in 2023. While the BU Terriers may not have as many stud prospects as BC, they do have two of the very best players in college hockey. Macklin Celebrini, the projected first overall pick for the 2024 draft, has an insane 32 goals and 64 points in his 37 games. And he doesn't even turn 18 until June. Lane Hudson is an extremely exciting offensive defenseman. He's putting up numbers that rival what Kale McCarr and Adam Fox did in their college careers. He was a second round pick by Montreal in 2022. Terriers also have 11th overall pick from the 2023 draft, defenseman Tom Wolander, who was selected by Vancouver. The Michigan Wolverines are the third team in the Frozen Four, and as per usual, they have a ton of NHL talent in their lineup as well. Their leading scorer, Gavin Brindley, has 25 goals and 53 points in his sophomore season. He was drafted in the second round, 34th overall by Columbus in 2023. Rucker McGroarty, who was taken 14th overall by Winnipeg in 2022, also has 52 points in his second season with Michigan. Dylan Duke was a fourth rounder taken by Tampa in 2021. He has 26 goals and 49 points this season in his junior year. The Wolverines also have second rounder Seamus Casey, who was taken by the Devils. The sophomore D-man has 45 points in 39 games and Frank Nazer, who was taken 13th overall in 2022 by Chicago. He has 41 points in 40 games in his second year at Michigan. The final team that will be at the Frozen Four is Denver. The Pioneers have a few solid prospects as well, and they also just won the national championship back in 2022. Zeev Bouillam is probably their best NHL prospect. He's projected to go in the top 10 of the 2024 NHL draft, and he has an insane 49 points in 40 games as a freshman defenseman at 18 years old. Jack Devine and Massimo Rizzo are two guys who were seventh round picks but are putting up unreal stat totals. And Tristan Burroughs was a second round pick by Pittsburgh in 2021. He's got 39 points in 41 games in his junior year. As you can see, there's an unbelievable amount of talent in the NCAA right now. And these are just the guys playing in the Frozen Four. I didn't even mention Jackson Blake, the fourth round pick by Carolina who had 60 points in 40 games from North Dakota as a sophomore. Also, some of the Michigan State guys, like freshman defenseman Artem Levshinov, who had nearly a point per game and should be going top five in the 2024 draft. Also, the Spartans goaltender Trey Augustine, who was a second round pick in 2023 by Detroit and had 23 wins and a 915 save percentage in his freshman year. You also have a guy like Bradley Nadeau, who was the 30th overall pick in 2023 by Carolina and put up 46 points in 37 games in his freshman season for the Maine Black Bears. With all this insane skill and talent, NCAA college hockey is as good as it's ever been, and it should continue to produce more and more NHL stars over the next several years. 
and let me know who your favorite player is in college hockey right now and who you think will win the Frozen Four 2024 National Championship.